Well, good morning, everybody. I got my got my truck warming up here but yesterday <coughs> looks like I got to get some more uh, some more mouse bait out here I think I just saw uh, I think I just saw one along the wall I had one down there behind the, the old refrigerator but yeah, I, uh, yesterday I was looking at some comments, might have been the day before, somebody suggested some seam sealer, and I've used this stuff before, I don't know how well it's going to work, but I guess it'll work, it's a water-based seam sealer on the canvas, on the tent trailer so and then I put the heater in there let's see how warm it is in there yeah, give me a second. there we go oh wow it's cooking that's not too bad is it buddy come here come here come here Easton come here come here come on oh there you go yeah Let's see here. Come here. <laughs> I'm thinking about putting my logo or channel name on the side of the trailer. And uh, I don't know. We'll see. I've also thought about getting another piece of metal and putting it on the side of the trailer for uh, some of them... Uh, other YouTube channels that I follow or any of y'all that want to send me some stickers I can I can do some advertising and uh, put it on put them on the side of the trailer so I don't know it's 35 degrees this morning and it's not raining but um, Friday morning I might be fighting some some drizzle uh, on my way down to Oklahoma. Some of you might not know that I'm actually taking a solo trip with the camper. And uh, I'll probably go be going live on Friday night with uh, two old people on a couch grumpy grandpa patriot show and we're just gonna have a good time they might even get me in the studio uh on saturday morning i think i i don't know i'm kind of excited to meet ned ned is uh mark's twin brother i guess or whatever you want to call him so but here's just a few things that i have that uh, I haven't packed in packed in the trailer. I'm just trying to get things out. I'll show you that here real quick. I dug out my old camp stove, my old Coleman cat stove, and I have a, a plastic container for eggs, uh, flashlight, coffee, coffee press, uh, my an old lantern i don't know i gotta pull pull that lantern out and uh i got a tarp a 10 by 12 because the last video i showed you that 8 by 10 really wasn't big enough i got an air mattress frying pan and some utensils plastic utensils and i don't know if the battery's still good in this old light or not oh my gosh look at that yeah it is good, so. 
and I got plenty of propane. And that right there is a first aid kit. Oh, bear spray. I don't know why I'm gonna need some bear spray, but you never know. I think it works on cougars too. So, I've been getting to work like at 6.30 in the morning and sitting around waiting a half an hour for them to decide where we're going and whatnot. Uh, leave me a comment down below what else I should take with me. Uh, got the sleeping bag in the dryer because I took it inside last night and washed it. But looks like all the seam sealer dried real good. Uh, anyway, I'm kind of excited to go on this solo trip. I'm still going to miss Miss Linda, of course, but... Uh, Hopefully we won't have to put the rain gear on. So tomorrow night, or tonight, it's gonna to be crunch time, you know? Getting everything packed up and going, so. One thing I'm curious about, I've noticed there's uh, like uh, cast iron uh, grills or griddles you can throw on a camp stove, you know, kind of like, it'd be kind of like a, a uh, Blackstone. I was really wanting to get a real small Blackstone to hook propane up to it. And they didn't have them up there at the, at the store where I was at. So I'm gonna have to do some shopping around. I don't know how well one of those cast iron ones would heat up underneath there if it'd take a long time or what, because they look kind of thick. So yeah, tonight we're gonna we're gonna be packing up, so getting everything ready to go and leave out early Friday morning. So hope y'all are having a good day, and say hi to a stranger when you uh, when you're out and about shopping or whatnot shake a veteran's hand too so we should have a good time if you're not subscribed please subscribe we have a good time around here and uh, hope you have a good time too well I better get my going to get my lunch box and get on down to work so Y'all stay out of trouble. Hit the big thumbs up for me, y'all. We'll talk to you later. Hey, tell them. Sit. Tell them. Say bye. <laughs>